What's up, guys? Welcome back to The Garage. Gerald here with you. It's been a while. I apologize. However, if A24 is releasing a new psychological film featuring animals, then goddammit, I am in. And that apparently is what is going on with the trailer that dropped today for a movie called Lamb. I haven't seen it yet. I'm going to watch it with you guys and then give you my A24 fanboy thoughts at the end. Let's watch the trailer for Lamb. And play. Ooh, Numi Rapace. Ooh, that's freaking sweet. I knew this premiered at Cannes. score oh have a feeling it's not gonna be that cute later in the movie <laughs> hey kitty I think that's the dad there right whoa Was that a kid with a lamb head? It is. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> God only knows. Kitty cat. It's not a child. It's an animal. Blood. Guys. Holy hell. Uh, just watch the trailer for Lamb. First question I have is, why am I not watching that right this fucking second? <laughs> that looks like it was tailor-made for your boy. Um, okay, so to give you my thoughts on the trailer there, first of all, I love A24. No mystery. I think everything they do is pretty innovative and pretty unique. So you're going to get a little hint of Black Phillip from The Witch, right? White, obviously, in this scenario. But they do this like animal horror, even in Midsummer, a little bit with the bear and the bear costume and different animals that were in that film as well. So they do kind of make this mystique around wild animals very creepy. You know, I just went to a farm recently and it was a goat farm and we were playing with these baby goats and I couldn't help thinking to myself about the witch and just like looking into the eyes of these animals. It's kind of like you don't know what they're thinking and it can be a little creepy. And A24 has a knack for capturing that just kind of unknown when it comes to human-animal connection there. So looking at the trailer specifically, I love seeing Numi Rapace. I love her. So I'm excited, so excited to see her pop back up in a movie here. It's been a while since I've seen her in anything, unless I'm just forgetting something. But I love her as an actress. It's an Icelandic film. It's supposed to be like a folk tale mixed with some elements of psychological horror. There were definitely a couple shots in that trailer where it was a human body with a lamb's head. Is that the case? Or is that like a dream or a vision? It could be any of those things. You know, A24 is not going to hold back when it comes to the, to the like, absurd and just kind of crazy storytelling. I'm really excited to see this. I love the cinematography and the visuals in that trailer. I don't know if it was shot in Iceland. I know it's based on Icelandic folklore, like I said, but just really beautiful. Really, the landscapes looked really good. The set design was amazing. I'm thinking that it's going to be in the parents' minds. There was like a grave site at the beginning of the trailer. So maybe they lose an actual child of theirs. In order to cope with that, they kind of adopt, in a way, this baby lamb 
to be their child. I don't know what to think, but I know I'm fucking excited to see it. And it looked like it's coming out in October, I think. You know, I do these trailer reactions and I literally watch them and then just give you my instant reaction. I don't reflect on it. I've seen other YouTubers like will watch the trailer and then they'll like take time to reflect on it and then they'll give you their thoughts. Maybe I should do that because I really don't know what to say about this, except that it looks fucking crazy and that I'm excited for it. Man, what do you guys think about Lamb, the trailer there? Are you excited to see this new A24 psychological animal horror film? Are they doing like an animal horror cinematic universe? Hmm. Think about that, A24. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below, and please subscribe to this channel. It really helps me out. I'll see you guys next time in the garage.